is the 17th day of February 2024. It's three days past um, the special day, Valentine's Day. And um, guess what? We are in the home of um, Vines Heritage. Vines Heritage Home, as you know, a home that takes us for um, over 200 children. Uh, these are children that have been um, rejected by their community and their adults and their family, their immediate family, and they have a new family in Vines Heritage. And we have children from um, one week old to up to 17 years, and they have been staying here for years. This home was put together with the support of ActionAid, um, European Union, um, ICO, Aduve, a lot of other partners that put this home together, and another part for us to put, for us to complete the home. However, what has brought us here today is to give out some gift item, a part sort of love from three sets of special people. The first person is Susan. To do lock she gave us funding to get beddings, bed sets for the infant, for the children. Um, the bed sets that are over there um, were able to get 15 of those. 15 of those. So that means that at least, Susan, you have provided um, a bed, bed for at least 15 children to sleep comfortably in. And that is what they require in the home. Thank you very much. And for course, a beautiful pillow that goes along with because of the budget. And the second set is Nestle. Nestle gave us 30 packs of water. What is life? Nestle, thank you. And they did it on, on Valentine, to celebrate Valentine with the children. Thank you very much, Nestle. We appreciate this uh, noble gesture. Like you said, this is just the initial step. We are hoping that we will get some more gifts that, that the children deserve. And the third one, and then the third of course, not the last, is our dear partner, Aiko. What can we do without you? In this home, you have been a solid rock behind us all through the years. And the children, the home. They say thank you to Aiko. Aiko gave us uh, gave us funding to get a lot of things for the children. We have um, toiletries, we have soap, we have food items. We have even baby formula. Like I said, there are children coming here regularly. They are brought here because their family is rejecting them. So this formula takes care of them. Imagine feeding 200 plus children breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Not subsidized by government, not paid for um, statutory by any organization, but they depend on organizations like Action Aid, like you and I, to come to their aid regularly for them to take care of this home. On, on a lighter note, this require a, at least, at the last time we came here, they require at least 200,000 plus on a daily basis to feed. So imagine that for um, 30 days in a month, imagine that for 365 days, imagine that for years that they've been in existence, one man and his wife are the ones living. Um, running this and taking care of all of this. So we call, we call on Nigerians, we call on other corporate organizations to come on board and let's take care of the home. Like it's a fine heritage home. These children have no business um, being hungry or being uh, living in, in, in poverty. Nutrition is a big issue. They need healthcare support. And we know that Nigerians were loving people. We we're able to do that together. I'm, I'm here with my colleagues, um, Sweba um, Dankabo, who's the Deputy Country Director and Director of the Program, and also uh, my colleague Nkechi. Nkechi is Nkechi to my far right, and she's the Director of Resource Organization and Sweba. This is my immediate right, the director of the program of the director. I've come here this afternoon, again, 17th day of February 2024. So what do we say to Susan, um, Aiko, and Leslie? What do we say? We say thank you. You can do more. Yes, thank you. <laughs>